Uh, thank you so much, Dan. So, a breach, what, what is that? That's any unauthorized release of information. Um, we're going to talk about security and we're also going to talk a little bit about privacy breaches also, so any physical releases of information. So this is at any point that you would accidentally send maybe a fax to the wrong person, um, that you would have, you know, we hope we never happens but a hack or somebody makes a mistake. Um, so we're going to talk about, you know, the main sources. So breaches often occur due to theft. Um, these are thefts of, you know, when we look at computers, uh, flash drives, um, any sort of media that may have information on it. This could also be paper files, um, people, you know, any, anything like that. Um, we have the loss of devices. Fortunately, we've seen a lot of these and we've seen some pretty hefty fines from these loss of devices. Um, this could be, you know, just somebody leaving a device in an airport or in a coffee shop and walking away and not and not realizing that and they have this information is unencrypted and not password protected. Um, as you guys probably have heard more and more about, we've got a lot of hacks happening, especially with medical professionals. There's a lot of ransomware hacks that are starting to happen um, and there's been some really high profile ones. <clears throat> we've had a couple that uh, the big one was out of uh, Los Angeles uh, and they ended up paying, I think, about $18,000 to get their information back because they didn't have a good um, security plan on that. So we're interesting. it's going to be interesting to see how that plays out in the next couple of months or years as that's, if that gets investigated by HHS, what kind of penalties we're going to see for not having uh, a good plan in place for something like this. Um, and then the, the one that captures everything is mistakes. Um, I wish I could say I never made any mistakes, but unfortunately we all make mistakes and sometimes those can be very detrimental to, uh, to our HIPAA compliance. Um, mistakes would be, again, faxing to the wrong person, could be, you know, leaving your laptop. There's, there's a whole slew of, you know, speaking too loudly in a, 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 you know, while in the hallway and other patients overhearing what's happening. So these are the kinds of things we need to, to look at and those uh, would be breaches of sorts just because of you're looking at um, that, you know, you're releasing that information to somebody who's not authorized to access that. 